Hey, what's up everybody? I, I, I know I've been promising everyone um, this video for like weeks now about basically how I got my results and you know how the diet works and whatnot, but um, I'm finally getting to it and, and here it is. Um, you know, here's another thing too, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be posting everything under Sculpted by the Gods and I, I know it's like a travel thing, but really who, who the fuck is traveling right now during COVID times? Um, so basically, I'm gonna start just throwing in kind of fitness stuff and you know, whatever else I, I run into or any kind of adventures or road trips and whatnot. But right now this one's about the diet and how I turned from a fat piece of shit during COVID. Actually, how I went from being fit to a fat piece of shit during COVID to back to looking like a badass and you know, about to post like pictures every Saturday and be like, fuck you guys, you know to motivate people and or at least piss them off so they do something about it but anyway um the way the way the way it works really i'm mixing in a um calorie timing type of thing with a intermittent fasting and as well as some carb cycling um but to keep it simple here here's like like the couple basic ground rules that you have to follow and and, and if you follow that you're basically gonna be spot on or pretty close where you're gonna start seeing results right away. And you know, this diet style, I've, I developed it, you know, from competing, I've, I've t helped a couple of my um, power lifter friends, you know, get ready for meets without losing any strength. Um, the way it's, it's made um, basically to try to keep you at the exact same weight while leaning out, because a lot of cutting stuff I don't know about you guys, but I think bulking and then losing 20 pounds and then bulking again is fucking stupid. I'd rather stay at 200 like a fat piece of shit and then lean back to 200 looking like a badass motherfucker, like a, a real fucking man, you know, not like a fat dad bod, like nasty fucker, you know, which I don't think that's something people should strive for, but it's not my call. Um, anyway, so basically I wake up right away, right? I wake up. And I drink lemon water, so I, I'll get like a gallon type of thing and I'll squeeze a bunch of lemons and keep it in my fridge. So as soon as I wake up, 16 ounces of uh, lemon water. Um, and what that does, when you drink the lemon, it alkalines your, your body. It, it, you know, thinking about it, it's acidic, but you're eating it. It almost has that like cooking effect of like when you cook meat in it. Or, but anyway, you're, you're, get, you're basically getting your body ready to start eating, right? So then once you do that, the next thing is to, um, what do you call that? You do some cardio, like if you're fat, you should do some cardio, like 15 minutes of cardio, right before you're about to sweat, like low intensity cardio. Again, you're trying to speed up your metabolism, right? That's the only way you're gonna lose weight. You have to always keep your metabolism speeding up. You have to be like shooting it all the time, like, come on, come on, like, you know, all day so little little metabolism hits so you know you just drink your lemon water as you're doing your cardio you're getting your body ready so then I won't eat for like the three four first hours of the day unless I'm gonna work out right away but most people if you're not gonna work out um, and you're trying to lose weight don't eat till like maybe like let's say you wake up at like 6 or something don't eat till like 12 that's lunchtime that should be your first meal and since you're not gonna work out right away it should only be protein and fat you never want to mix protein and um, I mean you never want to mix fat and carbs protein and fat or protein and carbs um, when you eat carbs you spike your insulin and basically all of the fat that's in your bloodstream is going to get absorbed into your blood cells and then um, so basically you wake up right that's the first part you drink the water you do the cardio first meal is um, protein and fat right then you wait like three four hours you have your next meal that that would be right before your workout so that's when you would eat carbs and a clean protein maybe like a chicken or something or some white fish right um, so then after that carbs the only purpose for carbs is fuel so basically after that you don't really need carbs anymore right so then after your workout you have like a really clean protein because if you eat carbs after you work out you're gonna buffer all of the elevated um, freaking growth hormone levels so basically you rather ride that growth horm hormone and eat like a very clean protein right after you work out because you know you probably want to the popular belief is to go and restore your carbs because you just um, 
wasted them and get your glycogen stores but that's not good for fat loss you know if you're doing like a bulking or a strength thing that might be good um but that's basically fucking it it's that fucking easy right and then you go work out and that's it um i'll post more more, more videos later if i get like questions and shit but um what i've been doing i've been trying to go right as soon as i wake up so this is the way I do it. I wake up and then I'll have like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, which is just like, um, I'm trying out this weird vegetarian thing that I don't really condone vegetarianism because it's not good for bodybuilding, but, um, it's pretty good for fat loss. And, um, yeah, basically what I saw on that documentary thing was that the, the protein in your bloodstream, like buffers, um, some of the acid or something like that. So I've been testing that and you know a peanut butter and jelly sandwich is just like a huge Energy bomb that if you're not gonna burn it um, you, you should never be eating that at all, you know, just clean protein chicken breast um, So I'll eat that right before the workout and then I'll go work out. So I have enough energy and um, Yeah, that's about it. And then I follow I have some clean protein right after I work out and then that's it Later everyone from the San Diego Dog Park. Um, if you enjoy the video, please check out svtgods.com and um, go ahead and subscribe as well. And other than that, if you have any questions or anything, go ahead and DM me.